Dragon is where? Oh, that's the 747. Yeah, that's not the little Cessna. He's the one that lights the whole map on fire. This could be pretty wild. Hey folks, welcome back to the hustle and bustle of Handyshire, year 126, and there was a lot of food just being hauled into the, the granary over there. Must be at winter, or late winter? The last of the harvest is done, they're all waiting for the spring rains. Here they come. Alright, so we're waiting for... I did hear something. Waiting for the inevitable Viking attack. Unless this is what the game is hitting us with. Kind of watching this here. I'm trying to find the best angle to watch dragons. He's over there just thinking about it. Like that. And, whoa! Swung over there. Oh, it's so hard to move this camera. Right when I start to swing, I get to the edge and it bumps over and, and uh, edge scrolls me. I wish there was a way to. I wonder if there is a way to turn off the edge scrolling and do everything with click and drag. That would be better. But um, anyway, we finished last time working on our new little neighborhood over here. Getting the services put in. And it looks like they're actually being worked on. Uh, no idle workers, but we've got five of five, three of three, and three of three. So we have enough to get the job done. We turned off our foresters last time because we we're clearing out swaths over here let's continue clearing chop and never mind it all went away all right then let's lay out some houses use that wood for for something um sphere of influence good there 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 so this whole area is covered taverns there let's see if i can get to the tavern Okay, click away. Let's go from this angle. That is a... That's not a tavern. Ah, okay. So, still haven't found a tavern. You a tavern now? You're a tavern now. So you're just covering in there. So really, this guy is just going to do this area right here. Okay. And then town square covers to there and covers to there, kind of. All right, so that that's it on town services, right? Click this guy. Uh, they want a neighbor. They want road access. They want charcoal. They want well access. Ooh, wells, yes. Uh, town square, church, tavern. And how much food is in the pantry? Okay. Charcoal is having a problem. We're finally outpacing our charcoal industry. Interesting. All right, so we need to boost that as well. Be nice to get it down here. Let's get the well in first, though. Town, well. Let's get huh, the wells, plural, in first. You. There? That looks pretty good. It won't show me, though, the coverage until it's built. So we know we're there, and we know we're there. So I think that covers this area fine. Over here, half of a church. Over here, not quite the church. So it needs to be within the range of the church. There or there. Nothing really does the town square. No, none of these are hitting the town square. So it needs to be on this side. So how do I get the road... Let's go one more space with road there. And, oh, I can. You can use the town square as a starting point. Interesting. So if I were to pop, no, well, I couldn't. I was going to say pop in a town square somewhere else entirely. Well, let me build that. Let's see here. Town square. I can't put that in anywhere. Okay. I'm trying to decide if there's a way to build on an island. We don't really have an island to try it. You know, you can start your road at your keep. Or you can start it at a town square. But there's no way to drop either. Castle. 
No. No way to drop either out into a brand new area to start roading. You still have to road up to it. Twelve peasants died from the plague. So, one more well. Do we road through here? There is a three by three. Do we road right here? No, we need our two and two. So, really, the road's got to go right here. Underneath these trees is nothing. Okay. So, we could three by three further down if we chose to. So, let's go ahead and road right off through here. And that'll give us access to our well. Right down. Well. Yeah, I want it right there. So, I guess one road segment right in that spot. Town. There we go. And town well right there. All right, so that's taken care of fire protection wise. I think we're good over there. Town well. What are we missing? This is barely covered. This one is going to. Yeah, this orchard really could use a little more help. That may be the spot. I think it is. You're going there. Otherwise, this guy's got no protection. That would have been bad. So right here? Or do we get more into... Like right there. I think I like that better. Let's chop you out. Alright, town. Well, what else do we have? You guys are covered fine. You're not. You're barely doing it. Where can I go? Too far away. I can go as far as there. Huh. Road's in here. Let's take you out and send a road down into this area. And we'll get the well more like over here. Um, did this happen? It did not. So two wells need to go on over there. And this area was fine. Alright, so that takes care of well coverage. Except for the two that we know about. Let's get some more... Say closing a 1300 for food let's get some more housing in town manners one two three one two three I don't know that this area was covered this one was and this one was I think it was I think it was it depends on the yeah. app so one two we have three major areas to build so we could go one two three four five six seven eight more manners which is a lot of people. Manor is 25, so 200 more people we're capable of just in housing right here. Wow. That's why I was saying the church isn't going to cover enough um, population to worry about trying to get the most bang for a buck on its radius. We're going to need two churches in here just to handle this. So, Plague has swept the land. Five peasants have taken ill. We should be able to take care of that one. Unless they're in a place that a plague worker can't reach. So where best for these houses? Let's hit the three corners. Let's do that. That'll give us 295? 75? Yeah, 295. So it'll keep us prior to 300, which means the churches will be fine. So town, manor, they, although that doesn't count as a neighbor, does it? Oh, that's frustrating. Too bad they can't be one block away from each other. Like a road span. Huh. Well, I guess I'm committed. Do just two there. We'll do groups of two. Alright. So we go that route for now. So that gives us the housing that we're needing. The wells. Was it there? No, it was there. So that's not ready yet. And I want to put a road in here. That's not ready yet. We need idle workers. What are the idle workers doing? I mean, we've got the two building projects, but that was it. That was it. Whoa. Let's pop in here and watch the... Uh, Plague worker, do his job. He's roaming through, just playing tag. Gotcha. All right, I'm get you. I'm get you. You're it. Gotcha. <laughs> yep, working through, and clearing all the plague out of this area. 
What's about a second one? There he is. I like witches running the town. So how do I get out of workers? I have to shut something down again, aren't I? Well, we have two working there. We have two working there. All right, we'll just let them do their job. We didn't get that Viking attack. We didn't. Of course, now that I've said it, that means we're about to get it. And this area is going to need to be defended, too. Yep. We need to get the houses in so we can get the workers. We've got plenty of stone going, but we do need to get more lumber coming in. So let's go ahead and turn these guys back on. As they finish those projects, those houses, they will uh, take their job again. Terrible plague, six pe peasants taken ill. And have I been ignoring my advisors? I have. Agriculture, too long to store the harvest. And peasants think you're an excellent ruler. And Viking raiders may be coming. Okay. I'm ready. Look at that. It only snows from that elevation down. Interesting. Looking at our town in the winter and not hitting the edge of the screen. All right. Well, too bad four didn't go to work on one house instead and just get it done. Year 131. Viking raid. Where are they coming from? Over here. Good. We're about as well defended as we're going to be. So who's coming? Zoom in here. We've got our four plus a tank. Okay, same attack. All the ships are full except for the tanks attack, the ogre. He's just got a couple of uh, a couple of carrying torches. All right, let's watch the carnage. That's a pretty good view. How many are going to drop before they get into the town? Doing a pretty good job there. Alright. The torch bearers are down. They haven't lit anything on fire. This is a pretty concentrated group over here. And while we're concentrating on this, these guys are sneaking in. Yeah, we're going to make it in. Are we going to grab anybody? We just might. Oh, it's going to be close. Though the torch did make it in. Darn it. Lit on fire. And we lit these on fire. Alright, where is Mr. Ogre? Where is Mr. Ogre? Ah. Distracted us completely, didn't he? What do we have for defenses? We do have two towers here. So we're taking these guys out hopefully soon. Where are those arrows at? Okay, they don't have torches on them and they're down. So, Ogre is the last one and there goes the well. One shot. Boom. Don't you touch my hospital. Now, we built this orchard here specifically so that he would take it out and not hit the hospital and the church. And it worked. All right. So I would call that a success. They're not calling it a success. They're, they're saying they're traumatized big time. But I think that worked out well. Very little damage. So it's probably um, arguable whether or not 15 wood is better than 15 stone. I taken out, uh, what was it, the well? What was the 15 stone? Uh, castle. These guys, 15 stone and 5 wood. Okay. Town, 5 wood, 10 stone versus uh, food, 15 wood. So what is the cheapest to sacrifice? Although this being the same price as many of the smaller uh, level items as far as building supplies does provide us food at the same time. That I like. So, I'm going to continue going this route. Town, well. Alright, that's good there. Happiness. Ooh. Well, I don't really need to explode the happiness, but we can do two festivals at a time now, right? Yeah, we can make all kinds of noise. But with the one festival, we're heading toward 70. The house is about to be built, though. Let's max it out. Let's... Boy, the bang, bang, boom, boom, bang, bang, boom, boom. 
lots of festival noise now. Hopefully that stays long enough for these to peek out and fill immediately. Anyway, we had fires over here. Everything survive? Looks like they did. Did... Yeah, we cleared this out to get a road through. So let's town and road through here. Right on down into there. And... We wanted a well right there. So town, well... Alright, that gives me well coverage for this area. And I wanted well coverage... Like in this area, right? Alright, so that covers this. That's already covered. So really it was this guy right here wanted covered. So if I went further down... Out there? Alright, let's look at the... That's good farming land there. That's very good farming land. What do I want to sacrifice? Could go... There. Which doesn't help this. I could go here. That may be the route. It's a little redundant. But that leaves me with good farming lands. Alright, we're going to leave that. We've got lots of options here. Let's not take away those options. Alright, if we had to, we could still road around, you know, through this and around that well. Okay, so that covers wells. We've got housing. It's got to be finishing soon. Seven more wood and we're done. Alright, so that takes care of that. We need protection down here. Okay. How best? We have lots of stone. And we're about to get lots of builders. So I'd say let's go for it. Now, we're covering at this point to there and to there. Which means a castle or a tower system right here would be uh, protected by both of these guys. And both of these can protect something out over here. And then these two can protect something out there. I kind of like that. Let's keep it redundant. So is there any reason we're going to punch a road through this? Don't really see the need. Though that would have been a nice farm. That would have. And I'd like to get more... That's right, charcoal. More charcoal out in here somewhere too. Maybe right in here. What do we do first? Defend it? Or provide services. I'm thinking we need to get the services going in and we can rebuild the services as needed. That's probably the best route. So let's get in a wood forester. Something like that. A stockpile. Where? And then the, uh, the burners. The... Uh, uh, charcoal. That road's probably going to go through here, right? Pause while I've got green. Okay. We're taking out part of his area by putting a road through here. I could take the road through here. He's not go At this point, he's not going to grow trees. Leaving those. That doesn't need to be a house. We're going to get 200 more people living in this area right in here. So this could be... Yes, let's do that. Whoa, touch the bottom. Back up there. Town road. Let's do that into there. Alright, so there's a pathway. Um, that means that this is going to be the stockpile. Right there. And more industry charcoal makers one two three I think so and then a charcoal stockpile what makes the most sense is there anything else I want to do that needs road access these do not need it Probably not. That could be the future home of a... Ooh, of a mine. I'm just looking down here. We're out of both. This all got turned back on, right? Don't know that I got workers. 
Yep, three of three. The mine is turned off. Ah, uh, there we go. So, open you back up. So, this the potential home of the next mine will be there. Otherwise, stockpile there. Alright, let's let that build up. So, new industry area. Get our charcoal back up and going again. One peasant died from the plague. Okay. So, housing 270 potential. Happiness 73. On its way to 88. Alright, we're good there. Don't need to throw a festival. So, we're back to planting towers now. And once this next wave of people move in, we're going to have lots and lots of idle workers. Oh, that was interesting. Oh, I see. They all went to work. We just got a whole bunch of people just moved in. 18 new. And they were there for a second, then it went down to zero. So, as these jobs get completed, we'll see them popping back in over here. So, let's get back into thinking about protection. We're good into... Right through the center of the the uh, stones over here, and pause. We're about to go into snow, aren't we? So we're covered here. So we've got this swath, and this swath. What's the furthest we can go out? Right here. No. Nope. Really, it's there, there. Back to this one again. This works. That works for both, but that doesn't get us very far into here for the next one, which has got to be like out in this area. Uh, where do we build it? So we had here, and we had there. This is housing. This is trees for the forester. This area is not covered. Unless the two new ones cover each other, but it's so nice when they're close enough that they did what we saw at the other side. Pretty much took them out. Okay, again, this area is not good here. It's this area right here. Alright, let's do it. Uh, turn that back on. Castle, stone, right there. Alright, so what does that look like here? There, there, there. I'm trying to figure out where I can go over here with the next one. Let's go castle. Let's go up a, one higher on each one. And now gets us into there. Looks like they're only we're not gonna be able to interact with what's happening over here. Unless I'm up ten you know, ten blocks high. The range goes up, but I'm pretty sure the accuracy goes down. I think that's the way it's designed. Alright, I'm gonna stop there. Archer Tower's needing wood. Alright, we're hurting on wood. Done a lot of building. These guys... Oh, these guys take five wood for each as well. Okay. So, all of our foresters are back employed. But we're taking wood to make charcoal. And we have made charcoal. Ah, okay. That's what's going on. You are going to be wood only. And you are going to be charcoal only. Back there. Until we decide to add ore and tools or something to this area. Which is fine because we never have enough charcoal to keep the charcoal storage full. So we can share. But sometimes we have too much wood. Alright, wood's 35. What was I doing? I was doing the archer. Castle, archer, right there. Alright, so with that, the archer reaches into here. Ballista does not... Where am I? Right there. That's interesting. The ballista has a shorter range? I thought last time I checked this it was even. 
There. There. The ballista has a shorter range. Aha. So, in that case, I would want the ballista on the other side. Let's do that. You demolish. You demolish. Alright. Castle. Ballista. There. Castle. Archer Tower. There. Okay. So, Archer Tower touches there. Ballista touches there. No, the Archer Tower is still running. Okay. But I think that's the next spot. So let's... As far as I can, it's only 35 wood. Five of you. We'll go to six of you and stop. Alright, so still three idle workers even after all of this construction. So we finally have a serious quantity of, of uh, population. 270 of 270. Year 136. And... Looking at my clock. What are we, about 25 minutes into this? So we can go for a while longer. Try to get the defenses up. All the services will be in. Food is holding. That's about where we were at the end of last episode. Even with all these extra people. So food is doing well because we haven't lost that many Grand Masters, right? How come there's... Dragon. How come there's nobody sitting in these fields? There must be. They're starting to grow. Dragon is where? Oh, that's the 747. Yeah, that's not the little Cessna. He's the one that lights the whole map on fire. This could be pretty wild. Though we're surrounding the area that has the most towers in the, sh the smallest amount of space. So we just might take him out. Oh, oh. We did, but don't you, no, 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 no. Oh, that was nice. You managed to miss everything. Mighty impressed. Thank you. And nothing put up barricades to be repaired. Good. We survived that one real well. All right, so I heard someone on uh, on the forum call this the Forest of Archer Towers. <laughs> so, yep, it's kind of looking that way, isn't it? I like that. Where was I? 52 wood. All right. Castle. Castle blocks. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right. And let's go probably over here with one more. So let's castle. I can't ballista out of wood. We can archer tower there. We'll ballista the next one. But I can't do anything without more wood. So with this area set aside for future um, farms, though there is something to be said about getting more farms over here first. There really is. So that, oh, so that a market has somewhere closer to draw from. That's right, a market. Does that go here? Instead of a house? Here or here? Because we need two houses there, two manors, and two manors. But here, we could put it right there. And that's pretty well central to the area. I like that. Food, market. You're going there. All right, that's good. Uh, wood, that probably sucked up all of our wood, didn't it? Food, market, 25 wood. All right, so I want one more tower system in probably here. And then probably one more over here, and that finishes this outer ring. There and there. That feels right. I wonder if I can get enough in here to at least mark the spots. Let's look at distance. You... What is this ring I'm seeing here? That is the tower. There it is. That was the tower. Okay, so that was the archer tower. That does grab this area. Okay, I put in a ballista. Can I yet? Uh, castle. Nope, I need 35 wood to test the, uh, the distance. Otherwise, over here. Clear. Thank you. We are hitting right there. So we're not going to be able to protect it from this side. We're cutting off right there. So next one here. And then one over there. So they're going to have to protect each other. 
Okay. 47 wood. Castle Ballista. You're going right there. <sighs> okay, let's go one higher. Castle, you're going right there. And then Ballista. Right there. And if I click on it, it moved. It, it went bigger once I placed it. Like it added one more height to itself. That's interesting. Huh. If I click you, you're right on top of it. So, there is well within range. These two. Can I build? Is that considered on it? I can. So that is within range. Let's do that and that. And here? Or here? Or here? That feels better. We can't interact with this one anyway. It cut off in the water. So this will get us a little more range out here to be shooting them while they're still in the boat. I think that's it. We'll just build tall enough to be able to touch each other's bases. All right, so I'm going to have to wait for wood to show up, so there's not much more I can actually build right now. No idle workers, so total one of our peasants died in mysterious circumstances. So no idle workers, which means we are overtaxing the system anyway. There's no point in adding more projects. So I think this is a stopping point. And I need to do a little bit of catching up. All right, so let's call this one done. It's been Noble Rambler. Thanks, guys. I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.